hi guys good morning hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm toby a film videos um about life in canada i share tools and resources that would help you transition into canada and all of that smoothly um so today's video is a continuation of my nigerian vlog my trip to nigeria vlog um I just realized that I didn't have an intro and I feel like this video needs an explanation or something like that. So this is actually um, a day in my life plus another day. <laughs> I don't know what I'll title it, but that's the whole concept. For me, it was like really interesting working in Nigeria for a Canadian company and all of that. So I thought to vlog it or vlog the whole day. But yeah, um, a lot of people do that. But yeah, it was nice working in Nigeria while earning Canadian dollars. And if you don't already know, Nigeria is five hours ahead of Ontario, so Eastern Time Zone in Ontario. Um, so the regular night of five was my 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. Nigerian time. It was a struggle. This is something you digital nomads or people that want to be digital nomads so should always consider. Like, look at the time zone before you choose your country and don't think you can do it because it is difficult. Like, I thought it was going to be easy. I was like, oh, I'm going to be able to do it, but it was a struggle for me. What was I going to say again? But yeah, this is something I might consider exploring. Like, I'm actually exploring in the future. It was really interesting. I did this for two weeks, um, but in the future, I might actually go to Nigeria for like two months or three months or like somewhere like Ghana for two months or three months and actually work from there. It would be really interesting to like live in Nigeria while earning Canadian dollars. Like that'd be really good. I'll probably be rich. <laughs> but yeah. Um I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, share this video and all that fun stuff. So guys this is my drink, my green juice rather. And I'm just going to take it now then I'm going to work out do laundry journal it's like shower journal it is see and prepare for work. But yeah, cheers. <laughs> I like this wig. I took it from my mom. Like it's so comfortable. Like it's an it's an easy wig, and the hair is really good. It doesn't shed a lot. No, it doesn't even really shed, and it's just easy to put on, easy to brush, low maintenance. But yeah, I'm done. I'm ready. I'm going to eat breakfast soon. I'll probably have um what's it called? Cocoa pops. I love cocoa pops. Like, I love Cocoa Pops, so that's good. probably what I'm going to have for breakfast. I'll see you guys downstairs. Oh, yeah, and I also need to do laundry. So, I have whites mixed and black clothes. So, I think I'll wait to do my mixed ones first. And, yeah. So now I have things in the laundry, the coloured ones, and I need to make cocoa pops. I don't know why, I'm just hot. I turned on the AC because I used the steamer and hot water to shower and all of that. But that's the thing, even if I'm hot, I have to take warm cereal. I don't like cold cereal. Except I'm using like milk in Canada where the milk is cold. I drink it like that. But if not, if I'm using Nigerian milk, like powdered milk, I have to make it warm. Guys, let me know which team are you on? Milk before cereal or cereal before milk? Um, milk before cereal. That's what makes sense. Put your milk before you put your cereal. I don't know how people put cereal before milk. Like what? It's just going to be soggy and messy. 
me maple leaf i use this area to work um what was i going to say yeah i think this thing was scratching the table so i had to put the mat on under i don't know i think it scratched the table a bit well here's my breakfast cocoa pops and water i might take iced coffee i'll see but I want to watch a movie, not a movie, I want to watch a show. I've been watching Silent Sunset, the new season. I can't remember what season it is. I think season 4 or so. So I just want to catch up on it. That's what I'll do. I still have like an hour before work starts. No, I have an hour 30 minutes. What? I still have an hour 30 minutes before work starts. How was I even rushing? Yeah, so I'm good with time. I'll just watch that while I'm um, eating. I also want to watch like African magic. I think I just like the idea of DSTV maybe because I missed it a lot. So I'm going to watch like some shows and all of that. But after eating, I'll just go to the living room, chill a bit so I can actually rest before work. There's nothing interesting. Nothing interesting on DSTV, like bro. So I have like 36 minutes to the start of my work day. It is 1.24 pm and I start work by 2 pm, so 2 to 10 pm. So I just want to get into like log into work, do a few things, then yeah check my email like this thing see if i've gotten any but since i still have um time i'm going to just play this then when when it's like 1 50 i'll just turn it off and actually prepare prepare for work but now it's just in a chill way but just to get people up there so it's time for my stand-up now it's actually 1 59 i'm going to join my stand-up meeting now <laughs> I'm just going to take Zobo. There's Zobo in the fridge. I'm going to take that and yeah. So what I'm doing is that I'm taking my break around Nigerian or the Canadian break time. So the regular 12 to 1 p.m. break is my Nigerian 5 to 6 p.m. So that's when I take my break and I eat lunch like that. So when I get back, it will be um, easier for me to transition back to like Canadian hours. So that's what I've been doing. But yeah. Let's just go to the kitchen to get Zobo. So I have my Zobo here and my small chops. <laughs> I already had some. I took the meat out, like the beef. So I'll just take it. I took one puff puff and pie and sprinkle. So this is all I'm going to have for now. And I'm just going to microwave it for like one minute, nothing too long. So I'm on break now, I'm done with work. It is 5 p.m. Um, West African time, so 12 p.m. Eastern <laughs> zone time. But yeah, I'm going to have salad for my break. I got Caesar salad yesterday from Dunes in Abuja. So that's what I'm just going to have a munch on for my break. And I'm just going to probably watch my show. I have to do something for my mom. She's back from work because it's 5 p.m. And in Abuja, you know, it's not like Lagos, so traffic is not bad like that. But she's back home now, so I had to do something for her. I actually have a meeting also. Um, this isn't a work meeting. It's a meeting with one of my friends. Um, something technical. Um, yeah. So 
after I have that meeting and I'm just going to eat my salad now and I'm actually just going to change my position and just just boring and tiring sitting down there so this is my second snack of the day this is turkey If you can hear the voice for this girl, <laughs> she likes this song. I said, Is that her best song? She said, Yes, so she's singing, but yeah, anyway, what was I going to say? Um, oh, yeah, good morning. So, I'm actually traveling very soon. Let me hope this going well. I'm traveling very soon, so I have to go and do my hair. I didn't want to do my hair the day before I travel because my flight is in the morning. I'm like, let me just allow one day to do extra things. So I'm going to braid my hair this morning. I only have 8 o'clock till 1 p.m. to braid it so I can leave the sun at 1 p.m., get back and get ready for work. Ah, this game's voice is loud. I hope we come out here. I'll just close this door. I'm gonna have to close the other door too because. Ah, ah. Oh shit! Yeah, if we do choreography, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, so I'm going to the salon to braid my hair. I was going to do home service for home service. The only I don't know. I was just like, let me just go to the salon. So I'm going to the salon to braid my hair. I'll try and vlog if I can. What was I going to say again? Okay. I'm going out with my mom. She's going to walk, so we'll just go together. I'll, I'll drop her first, then. I go to the salon. It's seven o five now, and we're ready to go. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye. <laughs> longer than what I wanted. I want to cut three and four. But oh, it's actually longer. I'll show you guys soon. There's a mirror here. But yeah, I'm done with my hair. I started it around 8 o'clock and I was done by 1 pm. I'll show you guys now. And I have to walk in like 15 minutes. Yeah, this is the hair. I wanted it to be this long. This is all we got. Like it's really long. Like here. Yeah. I really wanted it to be like this length. But yeah, anyway. That's it. I had to like, get ready for work. I have small chops. So I'm going to eat that now. I have my small chops here. I'm going to use this to start work. Work starts in like 12 minutes. I have my stand up mixing in 12 minutes. But yeah, I'll just use this to cool down. <laughs> Hi guys, so, um, yeah, it's actually 10 09 right now. I just ended work, um, that's 5 p.m. So 5 09. Canadian time or Eastern time zone rather. Hi people, so this is my second to the last day, kind of my last day because tomorrow actually my flight is early in the morning around 8 a.m. so I have to be out of the house by like 5.30 thereabouts so 
what was I going to say? Today is like my last day. Um, I took a half day today. I think I mentioned that yesterday. Um, yeah. So now it's time to like pack and all of that. Um, but I'm going to be multitasking. I'm going to be watching Blood Sisters on Netflix. It just came out. I think yesterday. I think yesterday, yeah, or day first day, I think yesterday actually. So I'm going to doing, be doing that and packing. I'm not looking forward to packing at all. But yeah, let's see how that goes. Friday evening, I'm tired, I'm exhausted. Um, yeah, I finally finished packing and it's like 11 pm now or 11 30 thereabouts. And I actually need to get up by 4 30 am tomorrow, so I'm just like, let me actually relax a bit and I'll probably sleep during my flight. But um, I'm going to use the massage chair now. I'm about to use this bath salts and have my jacuzzi session actually. Good morning. I'm wearing my leather jacket now so it's it's not always be good for me. But yeah, I'm ready. It's actually almost 5 a.m. Um yeah, I'm actually ready now. I just have a few things to pack from the freezer, just a few things. But I'm ready to come home. But I'll go to my second home. I feel like this is my first home second home. But yeah. I'll show you my luggage. I have like three boxes right now. These are my three boxes. This is my skill like measuring this thing. I've weighed everything but yeah I'm carrying extra baggage. Like it was concluded since there. Yeah. 